So here we have some water balloon. We are going to pop them with lava. Now let's start the experiment by plugging the propane with the fund. We are going to add the metal inside of the foundry. Now that the metal is melt, let's start the experiment. As you can see, it only takes a small amount of lava to pop the balloon. Look at this, it is still glowing. There is a small amount of metal that hasn't turned into lava. I have slime, let's see what's happened if we mix it with this glowing metal. There is a strange smell coming out of the pot and we see bubble appear. Now let's start the main experiment. First of all, we will put coke in the container. We are now going to put balloon on the pipe. We will now add soap.
and I choose to add some black paint. We need to add a special liquid to increase the chemical reaction. As you can see under the Coca-Cola bottle, I add a little bag full of Mentos that will this prevent the Coca-Cola from coming out of the bottle. As you can see when I drop the wooden board, the Mentos are falling and the Coke could mix with the content of the pipe. As you can see, the pressure tried to exit from the top but I managed to keep the container in place so the balloon could inflate. We'll now try to make an explosion using two bottles of two liters. In the first container, I will add soap, paint, and a special ingredient. This bottle will be connected to another bottle, and I will stick them together so that the pressure keep inflating inside. In the second container, I've put 50 mentas and a catalyzer. I need to be really careful so that the liquid doesn't mix with the catalyzer while I'm plugging them together. That was really a big explosion. I didn't expect that the heat destroyed a bottle, it burst completely. If you look again at the moment of the explosion, the bottle that was on top has fly in the air a couple meters away. That was very impressive. What I found strange is that the joint which linked the bottle did not break. can barely recognize the shape of the bottle. I have found a new kind of powder and I will mix it with mentos, soap and peroxide. What is strange is that I did not add purple paint inside of the container. It looked like the reaction has produced a color change. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and tell us in the comment what experiment you would like us to make in the next video.